from Holpzine.com. Thanks for joining me for another video beer review. This time something very exciting. It's a bottle of beer from Brewer Pinter in Poland. My first um, Polish craft beer and it's a bottle of their Call Me Simon. Come on. Who's in collaboration with? There it is. This is his name. My good friend Simon Mine from the uh, from Real Ale Craft Beer. So this is a 6.9% ABV as it says on the, on the bottle. Imperial Irish Red Ale. And this cool thing, I think they've got the, like the, is that the um, kind of Plato, or something like that. You get that often in kind of Ch in Czech Republic and Germany and things. Anyway, big thanks Simon for passing this bottle on to um, the good man Stuart Picard from Ginch Rail Ale Trail to bring to, it's right new bottle share upstairs if you can hear him prattling on. So Simon asked me to do a, a video of this. So this was Brute Pinter when, uh, when he went over to, I think, judge at the Polish uh, beer festival. I'm not going to pull loads of this, we've got another couple of people upstairs who will definitely want to try a bit of this. But as I said, my first of this kind of new wave of p Polish craft breweries. So beer in the glass are really quite a murky, um, yeah, quite a murky, dark, amber. Um, not much of a head, I'll give it a bit of a whip, see if you can generate a bit more of a head. Never get much in the glasses like this, but yeah, a nice, a thin film of a really quite nice toffee looking head. I've got a little preview of the nose. Good, good sign. Let's give it a sniff. Cheers, Simon. Oh, yeah. I mean, this isn't the freshest bottle, but it's still smelling pretty damn good. Oh, it reminds me of all those fantastic um, kind of red ales, rye ales from America, like uh, Hopper of Rye from. Berry Public, flip side from Sierra Nevada. It's got a lovely, loads of toffee, cinnamon, red apple. Oh, beautiful. Yeah, loads of um, quite sugary caramel. Like if you boil up a load of, uh, a bit of water and sugar in a pan, just before it starts to burn, it's got that kind of nice kind of caramelization aroma. Hint of licorice. The hops in there are really nice. It's definitely kind of red currant, pink grapefruit, that kind of thing. As I said, this is it probably it's a good, good three, four months old, I think, now this. But it's still holding up really nicely. Yeah, quite resinous, quite, quite, quite musty. I'm not sure what hops are in this. But yeah, yeah I speculate something kind of like Summit or Apollo or Rawaka or... Maybe Simcoe, but yeah, smells great. Can't wait to try it. Let's dive in. Cheers. Mm. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> mm. Mm. That's really good. Oh, I bet this was absolutely stunky when it was fresh. Mm. Yeah, it reminds me of all those beers I just mentioned Sierra Nevada's um, Imperial Red and things like that. I mean, I think. It needs to be an Irish red ale. I mean, I know Irish red is the probably the most prominent style. Uh, I think America. I think it's closer to American red. Maybe I don't know if it has any rye in it. It's something that really reminds me of rye. It's got like a crack of uh, black pepper in there. Mm. Yeah, grapefruit more this time. Bitter marmalade. Nice sugary kind of toffee in there. Once again, maybe cayenne pepper, cinnamon. Mm. Mm. That's really good. Nice kind of smack of bitterness. But, but then you get a nice reminder of bonfire toffee, I'm going to say now. And those kind of resinous hops and kind of like musty pine really kind of like continue at the back end. Mm. I could drink a load of this. Yeah, I bet, I bet when it was released, this was absolutely raging with hops. But it's still kind of hanging in there. And this is a skill in sometimes in certain beers. IPA drops off, when it, and when it drops off, it's kind of like, uh, it goes off a cliff. But I think when something is either rye or red, which re um, relies a little bit more on those malts, it can last a little bit longer. And this is still absolutely on stocking foam. Mm. I've got to save myself some. I've got to go back upstairs and hang out with people. Lovely. <laughs> Very impressed by my first tasted beer from Brewer Pinter in Poland and my first taste of 
Polish craft beer, but an absolute stonker to start on. Really want to try some more of their beer. Anyway, so that is a bottle of Rue Pinter's Call Me Sign Brewing Collaboration with the good man, the YouTube icon and national treasure, Mr. Simon Martin from the Real Ale Guide at 6.9% ABV. Lovely stuff. Nice work, guys, at Pinter. Nice work, Simon. See you next time. Cheers. Thank <laughs> you.